I'm Michelle Lawrence for Legit TV for this edition of the Senate Outlook. The 30th Legislature's Committee on Finance, chaired by Senator Clifford Graham, has a scheduled meeting for Tuesday, March 19th. We had an opportunity to meet and talk with Senator Graham about the committee's upcoming agenda. Well, at the meeting on the 19th, there are actually four items on the agenda. There were two contract for sales that the government had. Uh, we, we pretty much held those in committee because we didn't get the legal opinion in time. So we're going to reconsider those two um, items and we're going to hear from the Commissioner of Property and Procurement, Lynn Millen Maduro. It's going to come up and the first one is going to be the contract of sales between the government of the Virgin Island and the Phyllis Nelson Trust for a half acre of land in Cotton Valley, St. Croix. And then we're going to hear the government of the Virgin Island and the Paddy Birch Trust for a property of, of land in Estate Bovoni as well. And then from there, we're going to go into some requests for appropriation transfer from the Bureau of Correction and the Bureau of Internal Revenue. And they're pretty much transferring some money to shift some funding to deal with the high utility costs that they're experiencing at some of these two entities. Senator Graham explained what will be the next steps after the committee acts on the items. Two for the contract of sale, if approved by the Committee on Finance, it then goes to the Rules Committee and then from the rules they go to the full body to be acted upon. Um, for the two, for the, the appropriation of funds to move around funds, it just comes to the Committee on Finance and if that is approved, it's signed off and sent back to the Government of the Virgin Islands. If it's disapproved, it's also signed off and sent back to the Government of the Virgin Islands showing that it's disapproved. After these, we have some leases that, that's, that came in already and some are on their way as well. So we're looking at an, another meeting in April, probably around the middle of April, to address some of the leases um, that we're experiencing, that we receive from the government of the Virgin Islands, where they're leasing land to private entities. And also we got a heads up that there's, there's probably going to be a supplemental budget request that's coming down to the Committee on Finance, and we plan to hear that as well, if we receive it before the end of this month, that we would hear it in committee in the April meeting, probably around the third week of April. Tune in to Legit on Tuesday, March 19th, to watch the scheduled Committee on Finance meeting at 9 a.m. I'm Michelle Lawrence for Legit TV.